Cross your path somewhere. God has drawn the line. And he always warns you. You better slow up. You better stop. You better think. You better turn around. When you rebel and harden your heart and stiffen your neck and refuse, I say, go on. Go on. Go on! But I said, God told me to go on. And the day of Moses, he gave them a writing of divorcement and told them to marry again. But Jesus explaining it said, only from the hardness of your own hearts. And it shall come to pass. Deuteronomy 28, 63. That is the Lord thy God rejoiceth over thee to do thee good and to bless thee and to multiply thee even so shall the Lord thy God rejoice over thee to destroy thee and cut you down to nothing either we're going to let God bless us and multiply us and save us and God's going to rejoice because we kneel, we pray, we repent we turn from our sins and our wicked ways or either God's going to rejoice over you to destroy you and cut you down or not. And when God starts cutting, you cut mighty easy because you're so soft. You crush mighty easy. You don't think so have a head-on collision. And you don't struggle but a few times for breath. When your breath being in God's hands according to Daniel, God closes his hand up said in whose hand is thy breath all god does is close up his hand and when god closes his hand with your breath in there one more it's all over god said even so Shall the Lord thy God rejoice over you to destroy you and whittle you down, cut you down to naught? Because God said, Be a holy, for I am holy. Follow peace and holiness, without which no man shall see the Lord. What? Shall we continue to sin that grace may abound? God forbid! How shall we that are dead to sin live any longer therein? Awake to righteousness and sin not! For some have not the knowledge of God. I speak this to your shame. For whosoever committed sin is of the devil. And God can kill the devil any time he wants to. And it shall come to pass. That is the Lord thy God rejoiceth over thee to multiply thee and to bless thee and to do thee good. Even so shall the Lord thy God rejoice over thee to destroy thee and to cut you down to naught. For the Lord killeth, but he maketh.